Hey Comic Impact, Sheldon here, back again to deliver you what is surely to a brand new week of great, great comics for December the 4th, 2013. Guys, you made it through Thanksgiving. Hopefully you're not still in turkey coma because there's a lot of good books out there for you guys to read coming up. So bring it back in. We only have New Year's and, or Christmas and New Year's left of the holidays. And then we've made it to a brand new year. You, me, Simon, the entirety of Comic Impact has made it. With that being said, let's look at the comics. So, first of all, we have Amazing Spider-Man number 700.1. 700.1, you say? Yes, I say. Um, this is one year after his death. At the hands of Superior Spider-Man, Peter Parker is back. WTF. Am I right? What's going to happen with that? We all knew it was coming, but we didn't know when. Well, this might be the firing silo. The first shot at Peter Parker being back in our lives for realsies this time. None of that fake stuff. Um, it's written by David Morell with art by Klaus Jensen. And uh, the cover art is by Pascal Ferry. Guys, who knows what's going to happen here? Doc Ock might be gone and we might get the real Peter Parker back. I, I've been sick and I'm a little emotional. But I'm pulling it back in. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, I got this. <sighs> I got this. We got this. Up next, Earth 2 number 18. This is from DC Comics. This is by Tom Taylor and Nicola Scott, with a cover by Ethan Van Shiver. This is the new Batman of Earth 2. And uh, he, he tries to turn the tide in the war. We know the last issue, if you've been reading this book, uh, he kind of comes in and he's broken into this this underground uh, this underground sort of structure and we don't really know much what's going on or who this is but maybe this actually tells us who is in charge uh, and what's going on in Earth 2 number 18 folks this is a must read it's a great book I I wouldn't tell you if it, I wouldn't tell you to read it if it wasn't yeah you know I wouldn't so, next we have Elephant Men number 52 from Image Comics and Richard Starking and Axel Medellin. And this is Picking Up the Pieces Part 2, The Dose. Um, Farrell and Hip Flask are investigating a tragic lover's tiff, but perhaps there are bigger issues at stake. Well, what does that mean? Read the comic, find out. I thank you, Simon will thank you, and most importantly, Richard Starkings will thank you. Uh, so you want to check that out. Also, we have Hellboy in Hell number five from Dark Horse Comics. Um, it's Mike Mignola, Mike Mignola, and Mike Mignola. That's all that needs to be said. It's a continuing story of Hellboy in Hell. What happens? Will he make it out the other side? Well, only Hellboy really knows. And you will know next week. So check it out. Uh, let's see. We also have Nova number 11. Nova number 11 by Gary Dugan and Paco Medina. It's, uh, it's basically, I think, a, a, new, um, a new story arc. And uh, it's been a great ride so far with Nova. Guys, it's a great book. You should read it, because it's kind of awesome. Um, speaking of awesome, we also have Shadow Man, number 13, by Peter Milligan. Peter Milligan! And uh, with art by... Roberto Della Torre. Hey! Um, this is an all new creative team, all new arc. If you don't watch Shadow, or if you don't uh, read Shadow Man, uh, you, should, you should check it out because it's awesome. It's by Valiant Comics. The guys at Valiant, they can do no wrong. No, I'm sure that's not true. I'm sure they could do wrong, but not on this book. And let's go one more, one more for the, for the win. We have Trillium number five of eight, guys. Trillium, awesome. Awesome book by Jeff Lemire. Check it out. Jeff Lemire art. Jeff Lemire right. Uh, classic love story stuck in two different times. Only you and I can go through this together. Let's hold hands, shall we? I'll walk you out the door of what I'd like to call New This Week or December the 4th, 2013. I'm Sheldon, and I'm back, folks. Slightly sick, but still ready to party.